That's four hundred dollar recorder. <laughs> awesome. It's already, it's already working smoothly. Hello, David. Sorry, I'm 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 <laughs> And I thought it was every people randomly um, yelled my name. Well, Everybody here knows. I've got one, two. Yes. Hey. So far, this plan's working great. Hey, when you walk, pick your feet up. I think everybody's here. Don't plug it in. Oh, Alex, why don't we skip down? Let's. Shall we? Is anybody not tripped over the cable? Because we got a few more panelists we can just knock it off. I get a mic of my own now, which I need. I was going to say, you're not really going to pop. The other way around. Because they taken the bag away. And I went to where they moved it. All right, so let's get started. Uh, the purpose of this panel is to uh, ask questions of people who have successfully, or to some degree, uh, quit their job to do their thing. Uh, so let's go down the table and say uh, who we are, what we used to do, and what we do now. And then we're going to open it immediately up to questions. Let's start on this end. Hi, my name is Nicole. We have microphones. Oh. Hi, hi, hi. My name is Nicole. My band is Hello the Future. I'm the only person in my band. Prior to being and concurrent with being Hello the Future, I was also a project manager slash executive assistant at a think tank in DC. Currently, I am Hello the Future. I also do project management consulting, and I also do incredibly shitty content writing for the internet. You can applaud. Wires are an issue. Yes, yes, I'm noticing this. Hello, I'm uh, Tony Shadwick. You may know me from the internet and Reddit as Nomsky. Um, I was and still am a uh, computer person, uh, network engineer, Perl programmer, Linux administrator, all that jazz. Um, back in 2005, I quit my day job and started my own company, OSS Solutions, to do open source software for small to mid sized companies. Uh, that company doesn't exist anymore. Um, so I'm here to be the negative penny this morning. So great. We are, we're doing a couple of different levels of quit to try and give you perspective. So you can you can sort of address your questions. We've got full bore quitters doing our own thing and still trying to do it. We've got people that have gone that way and come back, and we've got people that are halfway through the process. So I think we should have some interesting information. My name is Joel Watson. I make an online comic called Hi Jinx and Sue. I did uh, sales and marketing and. Um, other horrible things for about a decade. Uh, the last thing I did before I did this was I sold websites to dentists, which is the dumbest wow. job. It's just unnecessary. The world keeps spinning if no website, uh, no dentist has a website. So, uh, next. Hi, I'm Christopher Bedell. I am the co-owner of Greater Than Games, a card and board game, a tabletop game company, and the co-designer of Sentinels of the Multiverse, uh, a cooperative superhero themed card game. Uh, before I did all that, I worked a dozen different jobs, and most recently I taught kids because kids are awesome. Um, well, they can be if you teach them. They start out not so great. <laughs> I teach high school kids, and high school That's kids, the worst. They're, they're the best. Oh, okay. They're the best. Um, I'm a full board quitter. We'll have a different panel later about how horrible teens are. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, David. Hi, I'm uh, Alex Bradley. I used to be a uh, graphic designer, multimedia designer for a uh, government consultant uh, consulting firm in DC. Because in DC, if you're working, you're working for the government. Um, and uh, recently, quit all that to move to Hollywood, basically, and uh, do something more interesting with my drawing and animating skills, like say, make animated movies and cartoons. Um, so, since about September of last year, I've uh, been publishing a webcomic called Miskatonic U, uh, about crafting the uh, university adventures, and um, I've also been taking classes in uh, motion graphics and animation to uh, get into the visual effects industry, or possibly also uh, like 3D animation or the animation industry. Um, That's good. Yeah, before passing around to Christian, I'd like to toss it back to... My wife, Renee, the oh. friend who came with me. Oh, hi. Hi. <laughs> hi. Uh, I'm mostly with him, but but <laughs> but uh, but I also um, quit 
well, I was working part time actually uh, as kind of as a writer editor. Uh, and mostly wanted to support him partially because I don't know as much what I want to do. I've never known for 40 years what I've, well, no, I've always gone back and forth what I've, about what I wanted to do, partially because of a lack of self confidence, god damn it. So fix that now, right? If that's an issue for you, fix it now. Um, <laughs> I, think, I think the spouse or significant other uh, or even roommate of, of anyone who is pursuing a dream uh, has a, a harder job than the person pursuing the dream. I swear, baby, just one more month, we're gonna make it. Somewhere out there, Karen Chadwick is weeping. I mean, I don't just want to be. And I, I'm, I'm not to diminish, him, not to diminish your efforts. I'm just saying it's a noble thing to follow someone into the abyss. Yeah. So uh, I'm also taking classes in journalism, journalism, and I'm aiming for entertainment journalism. So. Back on this end. Thank you, Alex. By the way. Hello. Um, Kristen Finney, um, I started, I did 10 years, um, 10 year career with NASA, Goddard Flight Flight Center, um, designing high speed computer chips right out of college. Um, and then actually did another three years with a startup, um, a bunch of people from NASA came and, and um, started another company in the aerospace industry. Um, I ran the IT department, um, managed that department there um, before quitting 13 years ago. I think 13 years ago. Um, to start with Labs with the husband, uh, Andy. Um, and it worked. And what do you guys make? Games. We make a game called Flood. There you go. Yeah. Thank you very much. I'm Andy Liddy. I invented Flux. And uh, I quit my job in 1998 and I never looked back. Awesome. So let's, uh, who's got a question? <laughs> 